Hi everyone, Chef Mark with Appliance Factory and Mattress Kingdom, and I'm in Thornton at our flagship location, and I'm shopping refrigerators. When you're shopping refrigerators, a couple things that you should know. What size do you need? You know, commonly they come in 30, 33, and 36 inch widths, and they come in a couple different depths, standard and counter depth. Once you determine that, what style? Now I know I'm looking for a French door refrigerator, and there's so many choices out here. This is a five door French refrigerator. This is a quad door, and this happens to be glass on stainless steel, beautiful. Here we have a four door French refrigerator with a extra drawer. Here's a standard three door French refrigerator. Here's a quad door refrigerator with some see-through glass. Turning the corner here, we have another beautiful uh, commercial style French door refrigerator. And lastly, we have a French door without water in the door. But one thing is common with every single one of these units, they all are gonna need a water filter. Because even if they don't have ice and water in the door, they typically have water internally and they have an ice maker in the freezer, just down here. And it's important to have that fresh, cool water coming out of your refrigerator that's been filtered. I think that tastes fantastic. And of course, here in Colorado, we have a lot of hard water, so I really think it improves the flavor of the water. So I have a tip for you. When you're shopping for refrigerators and you determine, yes, I'm gonna go for that uh, French door refrigerator with the four doors and the ice and water indoor, when you're working with your salesperson, why not pick up an extra filter, or maybe even two filters? They tend to be between $35 and $55, and depending on your water usage, they can last anywhere from 30 days to six months. I typically uh, get about six months out of a water filter. So if I have an extra one sitting on my shelf, that's great. Because when that light comes on, it's time to replace my water filter. Now I've got to come into a pine factory, make an extra trip. Um, why not have it in stock? So if you're buying a refrigerator, get an extra water filter or two. Now I've discovered that refrigeration, um, as it gets older and older, after about 10, maybe 15 years, they stop producing those water filters. So if your refrigerator's got a little age on it, on it, if it's six or 10 years old, make sure you pick up a couple of extra water filters, have them in stock, have them in inventory, maybe put them in that counter above your refrigerator. That way you don't run out because once they're gone, once they stop producing them, they're really hard to find. And my last tip is don't buy them on Amazon with a no name. If you have an LG uh, refrigerator, get an LG specific water filter. Get the specific water filter that matches your refrigerator. That's a bad place to try to save money because those those fake uh, water filters, we don't know what's in them. Oftentimes they're just shredded cardboard stuck into a container kind of with a label on it. Um, and they're not really doing the trick. So make sure that you're keeping your family safe and healthy with real water filters. This is Mark, Chef Mark with Appliance Factory and Mattress Kingdom. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe.